Hey everybody, the Bong is here, ready to give you a brand new Let's Play, Terra Nigma for the Super Nintendo, which is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Okay, this is one game that I played years ago, and I really, really enjoy it. The planet possessed two souls, an external face and an internal face, light side and dark side. You gotta admit, just hearing the heartbeat in this game is very haunting at times. 46 billion years since the planet's birth. Growth and decline circle the two wills. Yes, the Earth is not 2,000 years old. Live with it. At the will of light side, new life is born. At the will of dark side, ice ages descend. Light side wills intelligent beings. Rapid progress takes root. Darkseid's will breeds fear and disharmony. They came to be called God and Devil. Clock's broken, we're gonna need a new one. Oh yeah, there has to be that 13th hour too. It's uh, all part of like this new legislation that bring in a 13th hour. Yep, everybody's working longer now. I mean, you gotta admit, for a game that was released for the Super Nintendo, really really aged well for its time. I mean, just in the opening right there, that tells you that it's going to be a badass game. It's too bad North America didn't get it. In fact, it was the only nation that didn't get it, due to the time that the Super Nintendo was on its last legs and the Nintendo 64 was being brought in. Since it couldn't find anyone to publish it in North America due to the N64, well, we never got a release. Which is pretty sad, because I played this years ago, and it's very awesome. It's also the spiritual sequel to, like, Soul Blazer and an Illusion of Gaia. In fact, some people call it Illusion of Gaia 2 for some reason. Which could make some sense, as there are some references to it all. Uh, name entry, I'm just gonna leave it as Ark. Why not? I'm too lazy to come up with names. Chapter 1, The Outset. Yes, this game is split up into chapters. I've never finished this game, and I will try to get everything. All I can say is that you're going to enjoy the ride if you haven't seen it for yourself. Are you alright? Ark, you look like you were having a nightmare. I've been having these strange dreams, oh thank god it's not a silent protagonist like most other RPGs. Then again, Illusion of Gaia didn't have one. Day in, day out, always the same dream. Ark, I never expected you would say such things. You should go outside. Crystal Blue is in the air, and it's very pretty. They should help get your mind off bad dreams. As soon as I start dreaming of you, Ellie, the better. Then I'll probably need some new sheets. Anyways, you go over to this book over there to save. And that's how you save. It's that simple. Of course, you can dash by double tapping forward. You can jump with B, which is pretty cool. And 
Let's see, anything else? Actually, if you just tap Y, you can dash as well. If you didn't want to double tap forward. Hey, what's up? Yo, Ark! Ellie, wake you up? Woohoo, the hot couple! Um, she wasn't exactly on the bed, okay? The Elder told me something before. He said Crystal Blue are the tears of the outside world. I wonder what he meant. That they were the tears of the outside world. Maybe he was being blatantly obvious. Anyways, uh, more people. Ark, I heard you ruined everything over at the Weavers. Before that, you swiped all the pumpkins at the garden. You sure never give up. Okay, so apparently Ark is a troublemaker. Typical RPG logic. If I told you this, you'd probably laugh, Ark. But over at that door, you know, that the el one that the elders said we mustn't open? When you go past it, I get this spooky feeling as if someone is calling my name. Ah! Yeah, right, it was funny. What's up, Ark? Ellie wake you up again? You should be ashamed. Well, at least I have a girl coming to my room. Ooh, you mad? You got it good, Ark. I wish Ellie would come wake me up. Yeah, like that's gonna happen. Ark, come here. Okay. Ark, I hear that yesterday, you ruined all the weavings at the Weaver's Hall. Why do you always misbehave? Fine, I'll apologize. I'm sorry, but I didn't mean to do it. I was just teasing the chickens when they flew into the Weaver's place. If that is how you feel, go apologize to the Weavers at once. Understood? Yes, Elder, let me open your chests. You meddler! Who granted you the right to open that chest? What? You mean this isn't like typical RPG logic when I can just barge into people's houses, take their things, and then leave? Who would have thunk it? I want to go outside and see a crystal blue. The guys tell me I'll go blind if I see it. Ark, can you go check for me? Uh, yeah, but you can do that yourself. I mean, Crystal Blue isn't exactly gonna hurt ya. I mean, it does look quite pretty. I can't read that sign. Okay, just run up to a door with A to open it. Hehehe! <laughs> Ark, is it? Let's see your fortune then. This better be free. Hmm, you have the look of trouble about you. You best take care. <laughs> wow, that, that fortune kind of, well, sucked. Thankfully, she does it for free, because if she got paid for this, she'd have her tent burned down, or her house burned down. We're waiting for Ellie, because she's going to play with us later. Mom said boys and girls are bound by a promise from an earlier life. Ark, were you an elf, Ellie, friends from the past? Um, maybe? Hopefully we were of the same genders. Moving on. What is it, Ark? You didn't come to cause trouble again, did you? If you did, I want you out of here. Look, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, relax. Er, well... I thought maybe, maybe I did a bad thing the last time. This is a real surprise. You honestly apologized. If you understand, it's all right. We pour our souls into our weavings. Don't you ever repeat that kind of foolishness again. I won't until you guys forget. Ark, you should tone down your mischief. Hey, I, I apologized. Jeez, give me a break. Man, every time I do something that hurts people, people get mad at me. Why is that? What am I doing? Embroidering. I draw pictures with threads on cloth. Boring. 
Ellie's weavings are endowed with a special power of evoking happiness. I want to become an artist and weaver like Ellie someday. It'll never happen, you're an NPC. And yeah, you said the same thing as before. Okay, so that's the only dialogue you get. Oh, these people are boring. Hey, did I just go right through you? Yes? Ark, Ellie should be downstairs. She's weaving something the Elder asked for. No, she isn't. She was just sitting on the other side of the table. <sighs> Who needs stairs when you can just jump? I wish I could jump like you. Or like this? Just eat your vegetables, kid. Ark, did you see? I can jump good now. Not as good as me. <laughs> I wonder what Crystal Blue is. Is it harmful to my crops? No, but I am. Wait, did that pumpkin just talk? Yeah, I'll quit it! Here is being harmful to your crops, yeah! Hey, hey, you like me? No more cabbages for you! Ark, hey, look! You can see things reflected in crystal blue! I can see people and places I've never seen before! It's really neat! And this matters to me, why? Hey. Not even a nibble. Yep, I told you to get that super rod. It's gonna take a while for you to get that magic herb with no Pokeballs in this game. I wonder if that was a Pokemon reference on purpose. Who knows? Yeah, this must be the kitchen. And a woman's in there. This is the perfect game. Hi, Ark. You've come at the perfect time. Can you fetch me that vase there? I can't take my eyes off this just now. Okay, here you go. Hey! How dare you! You can go hungry today! Um, the game logic kind of forced me to throw the vase. You didn't ask where to put it. Oh, and your uh, pot over there is boiling over. Damn woman. It's no good. The door won't budge. Even when three of us push, it won't open. It's not locked, but... Hey, Ark! Just the guy we're looking for! The Elder has gone out. So there's this something we wanted to try. This blue door. The one we're not supposed to open? We want to see what's behind it. We tried everything, but we can't get it to open. Ark, you want to give it a shot? Oh, okay. That sounds cool. I'll give it a go. Way to go! Ark, maybe you can do it! Let's do it right now! Uh, it's not gonna work if I push on it. Maybe I throw something at it. Hey, there's a crack in the door! Way to go, Ark! Yep, vandalism for the win. Let's throw something else at it. And now it's open. Yeah, it's open! Way to go, Ark! So, which one of us is gonna go down first? Rotating square! Help! Someone help me! How was that? And now the square is gone. Hey! Did you hear something? I... I think I've got a stomach ache. Me... Me too! My head sort of hurts. Uh... I gotta go. You open it so you take care of it. Let me guess your ovaries are hurting. You guys kinda put me up to this and now I gotta take the blame. Isn't that peachy? Okay, this place looks very mysterious and blue. But we're gonna check it out anyway. Come help! Get me down! How was that anyway? No! The seal can only be broken with strength and a calm soul! Now! Soothe your soul! Calm down! Gently now! 
touch this box. That's what she said. Like this. Hey, it's a little pink thing. Phew! That sure was cramped. I'm free! But what is this? It spoke! Huh! You got something against me talking? Besides, what do you mean by it? I have a proper name, you know. Yummy! Sheesh. Something weird came out. That's why the Elder kept that box stored away. Nice guess. But you're wrong. The folk he feared his people will enter the, wor the world inside this box. For the innocent folk here, the box's significance won't be clear. Why is there a comma after the... Box? What happened to that box, anyway? Don't be so thick! You're holding it! Whoever breaks the seal on the box gains the right to own it. From now on, you can go to and from inside the box by pressing the select key. I'll give you a personal tour of this here box. Come along. Uh, okay. In-game tutorials for the win. See? This is inside the box. You can freely get in and out. Getting in and out of box. Why does that sound so wrong? This is the jewel box. Magic rings and summon medals are placed in here. And we'll cover those later, don't worry. You can also check your stock of magic rock for making magic. Okay, about magic rock, you're gonna find plenty of those throughout the game, and you need magic rock to use magic. To use magic, go to the item room and equip this jewel box. This is the battle handbook. If you don't know how to do an attack, read this. This is the strength mirror. You can check your strength, defense, luck, and experience points. This is the settings memo. You can change the config settings here. This is the map. Check it in a dungeon to see where you are. This is the journey guidebook. It has many helpful tips, so be sure to read it later. Let's go to the next room. This is the item room. Items are stored here. To use one, equip it and press the X button. If you want to show someone an item, equip it beforehand. For a description about an item, point to the item and press L. I'll describe it. It's the same for weapons and armor. Behind me is the whole hole. It consumes everything. There's a whole hole in the three rooms. Item, armor, and weapon. To trash something, stand in front of a hole and call me. Now go to the next room again. This is the weapon room. Weapons you obtain are stored here. Be careful, you have to be equipped with a weapon to fight. Let's go to the next room. This is the armor room. Armor you obtained are stored here. Don't forget to equip yourself with armor for protection. Now we're back here again. Now you! Go explore this box yourself. Oh yeah, you should go to the weapon room again. You'll find something about that awaited freedom with me. I think you'll get to like it, Ark. Well, if, if you say so, I'll go to the weapon room. Something to do with that glimmering light. Ark! The seal has been undone! Can you hear me? I have awaited here for someone who could use me at will. Humans, upon gaining intelligence, will learn of my existence. Using me, humans will gain power and expand their world. And time will revolve as it ever has. Like others before you, you have opened this box and met me. Have you the courage to use me? Yup. Then take me in your hands exactly as your soul desires. Oh, we get a free weapon! It's, just, it's like a spear. Huh? 
It looks like it took a liking to you. Oops. Looks like we got company, Ark. Let's get outside. Yeah, we might want to get out of here, but at least I got a spear. Ark! Are you alright? I heard that you came in here. <laughs> what is that? Sheesh! That's some great reception I get. I don't know, but it appears harmless. What's up, Ellie? I don't know. Ark, I'm... frightened. I... I... I feel terribly scared. I get this feeling that something is starting. Something that really frightens me. So, please, don't leave me all alone. I promise. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna leave now. Ellie? Ellie, what's the matter? Hey, you! What did you do to Ellie? Ooh, scary! But right about now, everyone in the village should be like that. What? Why are you giving me that look? It's not my fault. I was just trapped inside that box. But I owe you one for freeing me, so I'll tell you. A way to get that there girl back to normal. Get out of this cozy village and explore the world you live in. You should be able to discover the future that's been infested in the box. Later. Hey! What do you mean? Think you can get away? Well, I guess I have no choice but to head back. Oh, that's not gonna be good if everyone's gonna be frozen. How can I undo this? And God, even they are frozen. Well, let's see. Elder is safe, I think. Uh, can I even open these chests? No, I can't. Not yet. Ah, they're frozen. Even they are frozen. Oh dear, this is not good at all. Anyways, I'm going to stop the video here, and in the next part, we'll do a little bit more investigating as to what's going on. See ya, everybody.